Hello, Yota. Uh, can I go here? My sister is here. Can you give her a little hug? She doesn't want to be in the video. Do you want to be in the video? No. Why am I here in uh, an empty little parking lot? Well, it's because it's midsummer. Can't you tell by my little flower here? And we need a car, and the only car available is my family's car. My sister's got it. Uh, my friends are on their way because they have the driver's license, and we are heading out to the Swedish countryside. What are you doing for midsummer? Staying in the city. She gonna be a city girl. I respect that. The rest of the nerds have arrived. My driver is here. Hey! I'm gonna make them so uncomfortable today. It's gonna be great. Hey, <laughs> Ben. Oh. So we just got word from my sister that uh, our car has a tendency of just stop working every now and again. So that will be an extra little spice to the road trip. About two hours is what we're looking at. Hopefully, we'll survive. What the hell? <laughs> That's the best reaction you want when you step the car. What the fuck is this? We got a red light straight away. That's that's not gonna be good. We're doomed. What are you doing? That's how you check if the car is still running, by the way. You put your hand in front of the exhaust pipe. Now we're gonna fill her up and then we're almost there. Gonna buy some food as well. Look, we found nerds! Wave to the vlog! What's your name? Marcus. What's your name? Venus. What are you doing for midsummer? Drinking beer. Drinking beer. Like it. This is a Swedish tradition. Have fun. <laughs> very, very cool gentlemen. They were heading out to the countryside as well. It is the tradition. Hello. Been here for 20 minutes now. Have you fucking decided yet? They were summer league girls. I wanted to film them, but I felt like it would have been rude to put out the camera in their face. You think they're going to our party? I hope so. We made it. We are here. This place is forever gorgeous. It's a pretty big place, so there's and tons of small little red houses that people can sleep in, and people bring their own tents. I'm gonna sleep in the car. Right over there, it's like where the party is. Now, it is time for the traditional midsummer lunch. Meatballs, seal, and all these type of good stuff. This is the host of the party, Wave! Thanks for doing this. So I'm saying hello to all these friendly people. Way to the vlog, way to the vlog. The talks is already going around about last year when I broke my, what is it, collarbone? Oh, the collarbone, yeah. Uh, people like recognize me here for, for, I'm that dude, which is good. I'm like, I don't remember you guys, but okay, I'm the collarbone guy. <laughs> Oh, it's time for games. Okay, let's go. Games!
Time for this thing again, the old classic, the thing that people look to and go, why are you doing that? We're dancing around this green thing. And if you recall, this is the way I broke my collarbone last time. Midsummer. <laughs> All right, I managed to track down. This is Samuel. He's the host of the event. This is Hugo. He's a friend. These are the two gentlemen who broke broke my collarbone last time. I saw I you think. skip the berries to sleep. Yes, I was deliberately sitting on the side. Did you hurt anyone this year? No, that's fine. Huh? And, and uh, what about you? Yeah, no I was really one was eager there. to tackle someone, but I but I miss it. But you were looking for me, but you couldn't <laughs> yeah, find yeah. me. Yeah. What is your perspective on what happened happened last time? I was running away from the bear. Right. And then, uh, as you do, I, I nudge you a bit, and then you uh, was heading against Samuel, and then I can't right. remember. For me, it was like Jonas was tripping into me. Right. Naturally, I, I just like make sure I wouldn't fall. Exactly. And, and that killed. Jonas. And incidentally, since I'm, I have a very fragile gamer body, it broke my collarbone. <laughs> luckily, it didn't happen today. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> and luckily, it's about time that we. This guy fell earlier. <laughs> Let's look at that again. <laughs> Fatality. <laughs> thank you, by the way, for having us today uh, and uh, all these years, Samuel. Yeah. And thank you for not breaking my collarbone today. No worries. I like these guys. They're cool. Någon du var det med dem? Fattar du sen? Vad fan är det med dem? Tänk efter vad du har sett mig. Har du sett mig dansa ballet med? Skål! Another midsummer accomplished. GG well played. It's always a very happy tradition here in Sweden. Basically celebrating the fact that it's summer and the sun never sets. It does for a little bit, but then it comes right back. If you do want to experience something really Swedish, heading here and trying to get in on some of these parties during this time of the year is something that I definitely recommend. It is a lot of fun and the sun is acting up outside. It is a lot of fun. Right now I'm going to go and uh, do my workout, edit this vlog, and then it's another week. Next week I'm actually heading to London on Tuesday to Thursday, just a short little visit. Gonna meet some of the people on Twitch. So expect a little vloggy roof from there probably around Thursday or Friday maybe. Stream is gonna be per usual. It might start a little earlier on Tuesday because I'm gonna have to catch my flight on Tuesday evening. And also lately I've been streaming a little bit more frequently on uh, bonus days as well. So go and check out the stream. Go and follow the stream. Make sure you don't miss out. Okay. Before we're done, let's do a little question of the day. I have my laptop here. All right. This one comes from EXITXD. Did you meet some German YouTubers lately? Spotted you in one of their videos, Dave? Yes, indeed I did! Through the company Epidemic Sound, who provides uh, me with the music when I don't go to Vexento or some of the other cool YouTubers that I use. I met with uh, Cheng Liu, is that how you pronounce it? I hope so. And some of his entourage and some other cool people as well. We just hung out, we did some fun stuff here in the city. Went out, grabbed a couple of drinks, talked a little bit. Super pleasant people. And I've got to say, like, I've been in this uh, business <laughs> since 2011 now. I've, I've been doing this for a while and when it comes to meeting other YouTubers, of course there are some exceptions, but generally they just tend to be super pleasant people. I never really got to analyze it, but I think it might have to do with the fact that no one of us started this because we wanted the fame or we wanted the monies or we wanted something else. Again, there might be some exceptions, but generally. And when something starts happening, you get like this humble and graceful attitude towards it. And that sort of colors your entire human being, I feel. So it is very rare that I meet other YouTubers that are like douchebags. And I really like that. Something that I really enjoy. Click here to subscribe, click here to watch the previous vlog. And if you want, you can leave a comment down below and I might take it up in the next vlog. Get a little question of the day action going. You like that? I like that. I like you. Do you like me? I hope so. This has been Spazzy and I'm out. Do it!